Hello everybody, um, I'm back. Uh, I've had uh, a couple of weeks off uh, and that's been very helpful. Uh, nine days at Grasmere in a cottage, uh, which is quite funny really because it's the same cottage that we would have a holiday in March about uh, that I got one day of the holiday and then ended up having to come home and to isolate myself for seven days. So it was lovely to go back and to enjoy what is a very peaceful area uh, and just relax. Well, here we are back. And uh, first thing, uh, almost, is that um, our Prime Minister stands up and says that there are new restrictions. And suddenly we thought that the plans to have our church open on this next Sunday were going to have to be dumped. But the Archbishop of Canterbury phoned uh, government officials and discovered that it doesn't affect churches. So thank you, uh, Mr. Welby. That's very kind of you. Uh, so we are open on Sunday at 11 o'clock up at Woodbank Community Church, and uh, I'm really pleased about that. Actually, of course, we're cheating. I seem to do an awful lot of that, don't I? Um, we're not actually going to have a service that's unique to the just the church. We're actually going to show the online service to those who want to meet. One of the things we want to do is to test our systems, make sure everything is safe, that people know what they're doing. And it just seemed a great opportunity to do that. We may do that for a couple of weeks uh, until we know uh, and have worked out how we can uh, uh, put services online from the church and that really is what we want to do in the end uh, so that what we started as a, a necessity to go online will continue because we've made a whole load of new friends online and we don't want to lose you um, and uh, so uh, keep watching this space and you'll see uh, what's going on uh, thank you for um, all the support and encouragement that you've given to us. But talking of support and encouragement, there is a great need for more of that in these coming days. Um, we're starting to think, well, will we be having Christmas services and what will they look like? Uh, you might be thinking, well, when is this all going to stop? This is a real time to support each other and to encourage each other at a time that can be very discouraging. You may be on furlough and you know that that's going to end very soon and you may be worried about your job. There are so many th things for us to worry about. Our children have gone back to school, our older children are going off to university, how's that going to work? And then of course there's Brexit as well. Just to add to the mixture, uh, as if we haven't had enough already but please think about the people around you pray for them uh, if you don't normally talk to God just talk to him this once and ask for his help and ask for his help for people you know who are struggling perhaps lonely people that uh, you're aware of um, perhaps people who today are absolutely scared that the people are not taking any notice of what you are terrifyingly fearful of. You know, there's, this is a real time for us to look out for others. Do unto others, the Bible says, uh, what you'd have them do unto you. In other words, if you were lonely, if you were worried, if you were scared, if everything seemed to be just too much for you, would you appreciate it if somebody was just there not pushy but just there thinking of you praying for you well do unto others you pray for them you encourage them you smile at them oh of course that doesn't if you've got a mask on smiling doesn't work does it no um, though I've noticed I've seen people smiling eyes but if it's a bit of a distance you won't see that at all will you thinking of that be very aware also of those who struggle with these masks that we have to wear, who perhaps are asthmatic but feel the pressure to wear them. Or maybe they're partly deaf and they rely an awful lot on lip reading and suddenly they can't. Be aware of that as well. Uh, I find that. Uh, and it's a, it's a struggle sometimes to hear really what people are saying. So be thoughtful. Somebody doesn't seem to understand what you've said, it's possibly that 
So say it again um, and uh, just encourage one another. Anyway, here I am back up on holidays, long time till the next one. So uh, we've got to learn how to just get on with things like everybody else. Lord bless you this week. The Lord encourage you. Um, and just stick by him. He knows what he's doing. And remember what I said. You see people that are in need, pray for them. Ask God to bless them. Uh, even if you're not normally talking to God, still ask him. Okay, I will talk to you again next week and I'll tell you how our first opening service went and what we learned from it. Okay, have a good weekend. Bye.